Hello everyone, um, just doing a quick video to show you how you can play Battlefield 4 on play PlayStation 4 using a keyboard and mouse. So, on mouse, on keyboard, I'm using a tablet for uh, my Linux setup, but I've also got a Raspberry Pi. I need to. I um, haven't fired that up yet, but I will do eventually. So, I put all the relevant links into where you can get all this software from. Uh, there is some hardware that you've got to buy. Um, it's not that expensive. This is a Teensy. Um, you don't actually need this this part here, the USB element. You need this here. Um, absolute peanuts from eBay. Um, well, there's a dedicated link I'll put all into the description itself but essentially this is how I do it so once you've got all the software downloaded it's very straightforward there's all the forum details um, the name of the guy um, I just can't remember at the moment but I'll put the links all in there but generally all you need to do is you'll go into a fo folder which is already set up if you're not familiar to uh, Linux, you'll get used to it very quickly. There's a lot of help pages. So I'll jump into the folder and I'll there's a helper document that is it's in there, so I'll drop my password in. What we'll do is it'll give you instructions. I'll just bring this up slightly. You can't really see that too well. So uh, press enter. Put your Bluetooth dongle in. This might have a bit of a wobbler because I'm flipping between the Wi Fi and so on. So it's just asked me for the uh, PlayStation controller. I've already got this plugged in, but you just go through the instructions. So you plug your PlayStation 4 controller in. It'll ask you to then unplug it. So as soon as you unplug, it'll ask you to plug the TNC in, which is the hardware that I referred to earlier. So you plug that in. Now it asks you to unplug it. Plug that into the PlayStation socket once it's on. Generally count for 10 seconds, so okay. take it out, plug it back in. I tell you that everything's been set up successfully. In the help pages, just to help everyone get speedily along, it does tell you to uh, do a Bluetooth stop function. So turn that off. Then this is the next part, and I find this is always the successful part. Is I call up my configuration file again, read through the forum. It's all documented in here. So just. Press enter, straight away press the PlayStation button. This, in fact, I might as well go through this at the same time, is this can sometimes come up if you've already done this on the PlayStation. Don't worry, because what we can do is just close this down, start it all again. So I'll whiz through this very quickly. Take out Bluetooth, press your enter, put your Bluetooth back in, on hold. Put your controller in, then you unplug it, unplug your T 
teensy board into PlayStation. Wait about 10 seconds. The instructions will come up there until you use it to plug it back in, that's fine. Everything's up and running. Stop the Bluetooth. Get your configuration file. Press your button. A flash like that. You can see it. And now, if I flip across to here, you can see um, using the keyboard, I've set this up exactly how I want it. Quickly get into Battlefield. So there we go. Mouse time. Just turn it back slightly. So I can see this. You can customise your keyboard with this, it's exactly how you want. So the trusty PC gamers amongst us will be able to do Battlefield. As many want, so I'll just go into go into the test range, be just quicker and try to get into a server. So here we go. So um, difficult to show, but if I do this, use my hand, you can see it's using the mouse direction. People will obviously hate this, other people will love it. For the price that this has cost me, it's absolutely peanuts. You can see that there's no real effort needed to hit things at distance. Even moving targets. Except I'm a rubbish shot. Try again. There you go. Right, I'll pull the relevant links in for you guys. So if you want to do this, obviously, if you're PlayStation 4 and you've got Battlefield 4, it's brilliant. Um, if you come up against me, you might lose. Okay, thanks a lot.